Hi everyone, my name is Anang Shalomyan and welcome back to my channel. This is a brand new episode of my series AI with Anangsha where I show you cool AI tools that can upgrade your life in seconds. Today's cool AI tool is an AI for interior design. Now you might be wondering how can I even use AI for interior design? Well, let me show you how. The tool that we're talking about today is called My Room Designer AI. So when you click on the link in the description of this video, this is the homepage that you will see. MyRoomDesigner.ai is a AI that's specifically designed for redecorating your interiors. It has multiple cool features like photo analysis, design generation, chat with photo, upscaling your favorite photo, and a cool mood board editor. Let me show you all these features one by one. So the first step is to head over to the link in the description of this video. And this is the homepage that you will see. Then you have to create your account and let the AI transform your room. Let's click on get started. And this is the first space that you will see where you have the option of restyling or inspiration. So let's click on restyling and I want to change the interior design of my bedroom. So I'll select bedroom and then I'll upload a picture of my bedroom. I just clicked a picture a few days back just for uh, getting it redecorated. So I have uploaded this image and this image is being analyzed. Until then, let's choose a style. You have multiple styles you can choose from. Just because I'm feeling a bit boho today, let's click on Bohemian and uh, select some colors that we would like. I would always choose white, beige and light brown. Uh, we can also write down what changes we like. Like for example, we can write about add an abstract painting on the wall. Uh, there's also an option of writing a full prompt like for example me personally I cannot change this is a rented space so I cannot change the door and the window so I have kept this prompt as keep the left wall door and the window as is the bed is centered against the blue accent wall uh, so I have inputted the kind of things that I cannot change in the room and I've also written a bit about how the ceiling is like I have also given some additional instructions like incorporate a cozy area rug under the bed, uh, some soft textiles like throw pillows, blanket, etc. Uh, keep the window treatments minimal for a clean look. This is the prompts that I have given. You can select the number of variations you want. Let me select four variations and then let's click on generate design. In just few seconds, the AI has given me so many options of my room to select from. So this is the first style and this is the second style. I really love these styles. These are really pretty. So once you like a style, you can. There are two options. First is to select and chat, which is a really cool option. I'll show you that later. But another option is create similar basically means if you like this style you can ask the AI to create a few similar variations of that image and now I have four similar designs in the style that I had liked let's pick one which we love the most for me personally it's this I like this so I'm going to click on select and chat so this is a really cool feature of my room designer AI where you can actually chat with the AI and make changes in this particular image so for this image, I wrote the prompt, remove the bookshelf and add an abstract painting to the wall. So this is the bookshelf. I asked the AI to remove it. And this is the updated image, keeping my changes in mind. So the bookshelf has been removed and the blue accent on the wall has also been removed. And now there's an abstract painting on the wall, which looks really good. Once you have made the desired changes and you really like this image, you can either download it, share it with your friends, or you can also upscale it. Upscaling it basically means enhancing the quality so you can print it out you can show it to the people who are redesigning your home and you can get results that look exactly like this in your actual room. So now this image has been upscaled. I am zooming in and this quality is remaining intact. This is a good high quality image. It definitely serves my purpose. Another cool feature of My Room Designer AI is find similar products. When you click on it, you are going to be led 
to Google where you can actually shop for products that appear in the image. So you can redecorate your house exactly like the AI had envisioned for you. So I'm going to select the part, this part of this image and I'm pressing enter. So now Google will look for similar abstract paintings. Uh, these are from websites where I can check and I can purchase them and make my room ex look exactly like how I had designed it using this AI. There's another option called add to designer. If you click to this, your image will be added to a mood board where you can add images of different rooms of your house. Say this is the design for my bedroom. I can use this mood board to add designs for other rooms and then I can have a visualization of how I want my entire house's interiors to look like. I can also add products to this mood board. Like I can edit here and I can write the name of this uh, mood board, say dream redecoration of house and I have saved this here. Uh, I can also make this public and I can share it with my friends. I can share it on my social media, ask for opinions. I can look for different color palettes uh, for the background just for aesthetic purposes. We know how important uh, it is that our mood board looks pleasing to the eye. Now my room designer AI has other cool options like a mood board AI. Let's check the mood board AI. So what you have to do is go to the top left, click on mood board AI and this is what you would get. Uh, let's click on start to create now. So here we can generate our own living room uh, mood boards with AI. So here you can select like if you're planning for interior design, but it also has other options for fashion, wedding, food branding, food photography, restaurant photography, and so many other options. I will show you first interior design and let's select bedroom. Let's select the styles as bohemian and the colors as neutrals landscape uh, the the aspect ratio of the photo is fine we can also add products to mood board this basically means if you have uh, saved certain sofa styles or bed styles and you have saved these images you can upload them upload these images here and now you can describe what changes you would like to this images i'm going to just click on generate and let's see what mood board ai comes up with I got some cool bohemian inspirations for designing my uh, bedroom. I can select and chat and I can also generate variations of this image. This is a really cool feature that My Room Designer AI has and I'm a huge fan of this. Now let me remind you, you can see all your previous designs by clicking the top right and going to your dashboard. And here you can see all your recent designs on your dashboard. These are the recent designs in my mood board. If I click on my room designer AI, I would see my recent designs here on the dashboard. Like uh, this is the bedroom design that I really enjoyed. I can click on it again and I can generate multiple images as well. Say I had only selected Bohemian so I can select other styles. I can generate as many designs as I like and based on which one speaks to my heart and my soul the most, I can pick that and I can get my house redecorated. Let me show you a quick before and after of the design that I achieved with My Room Designer AI. This was how my room looked like initially and this is how it was reimagined with My Room Designer AI. I love how easy it is to design your entire house, reimagine your entire house with the help of AI. And I'm in awe of the versatility and the multiple design options this tool has. So if I had to recommend you a single tool that you can use to redecorate your entire home, it would definitely be myroomdesigner.ai. Now let me quickly show you how you can plan weddings or you can plan your food photography etc using mood board AI. So when you click on start to create now, let's click on wedding. And let's click on the styles, classic wedding, colors, since I'm Indian, I'm going to select red, orange, yellow. And let's click on generate. These are the default prompts, wedding bouquet, wedding cake, invitation, venue, decoration, bride's dress, 
groom suit, accessories, photo corner, etc. So these are the inspirations that I got for a wedding planning. Pretty interesting. I love the options that we have. I would also like to show you some options that we have for fashion. Uh, you can select your styles from boho, business casual, street, vintage, glam. I'm going to select glam. This time I want to uh, have some blues in my mood board. And um, let's select skirts, crop tops, heels. And let's click on generate. These are the options that we got. I love how many different styles we got in just glam and i can select and chat i can talk with the ai to make any changes as i like so yeah like i was saying myroomdesigner.ai is a super powerful tool depending on what you need it for this tool can be your best friend definitely do give this cool tool a try let me show you my before and after results once again to inspire you a little bit more don't forget, you can click the link in the description of this video and, and start creating your mood board today. I hope you enjoyed this video. I make new videos pretty much every week. So please do subscribe to my channel so you don't miss out on future content like this. I'll see you again super soon. Until then, stay awesome and keep hustling. Cheers!